Hi guys, I guess my bamboo shrimp are either liking or hating their new tank. I'm not sure, but they're hanging out tonight. And they are kind of big. Cause, see that Corbenzis? He's kind of big. Here comes another one. Where you at, big guy? Which usually you want to catch them hanging on stuff. So I'm not sure, but I don't know if it's just getting used to the new tank or what. Because in the other tank, they hung on the sponge filter all the time. And they have an old sponge filter and a brand new one in here, so they have their pick. This tank has been set up um, two months more, maybe. This is my very first dirted aquarium. And I've been pleased with this one from day one. Haven't had any issues. And... Of course, now I have a whole lot more fish in here, but um, I, it was at least three weeks or so before I even thought about having to do a water change based on my uh, parameters. So I'm having to anchor down this piece of driftwood because it, even though it came with a piece of slate on it, it still floats to the top. And it's been in water for three weeks. Who we got in here? Oh, the Siamese algae eater. They just look like sharks to me. <laughs> But I love these shrimp. They make these little clicking sounds, like when you net them and move them. And I have heard of clicks before. I didn't realize it was them making it. But moving them yesterday, I, I heard several of them make little click sounds. And of course, he's kind of mad with me because I took his lady away. But they've already had two batches of babies in the last, well, since March. And they can't absorb it, just so many crabenzas. But overall, this is a favorite tank. It's not the biggest tank, but it's still one of my favorites because it has been so easy. And this is mostly based off of Father Fish's um, way of doing a tank. So I have to say, for my water and all, this one has worked out great. Thanks for watching. Catch you the next time. Bye.